Well, everybody, let's have a chat. Let's have a chitty chat. I'm never gonna say that again. <laughs> Hello everybody, the sun is in my eyes. I am in Orno, Maine right now, and it is absolutely, fabulously beautiful. We are staying at the, I think it's called the University of Maine Inn. Um, my dad went to the University of Maine, and my grandfather also went there, so we're here for a alumni situation. I have my, got my wristband, and my fancy name tag. It's so beautiful here. I honestly, I don't know, I think Maine, is definitely one of my main states. Ha <laughs> ha. No, but it's absolutely beautiful. We have a cottage from Maine and it's my favorite. It's my happy place. This is my happy place. Guys. 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 It's so beautiful. Like the best sound is crunchy leaves, guys. Crunch, 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 and the crunch of my talking. I'm actually kind of curious as to where this path leads. It's my dad staring at me from the porch. Oh, this area is just too pretty. It's too beautiful and gorgeous. And Ah, oh, it makes me so happy. Oh, look at this. This is a cool tree. Continue walking down to see how far it goes and what it leads to. I hope I am still on the property of the hotel. some sort perhaps. Good morning everybody! It is beautiful out yet again. We are gonna get into a canoe because the dad does not like kayaks. And we're gonna canoe on the water for the morning and then head home. But first we have to pack. And you are sleeping. He's sleeping. I think I have everything though. I think we're good. I'm gonna miss Maine, but I'm very happy going back home because Worcester also looks absolutely beautiful this time of year. And I'm definitely gonna be happy no matter where I live as long as there are beautiful trees that change color and I'm near water. Just look at that. So beautiful. I think my favorite part of hotel rooms is definitely this desk that's so right near the bed. I always feel very fancy doing homework at it and like editing videos and it kind of makes me excited for next year when I have my own bedroom and I can like have a nice fancy desk with my nice desk chair next to the end of my bed so I can do homework and be all fancy. I don't know guys, these are the things I look forward to in life and I think it's kind of important to find those little things that make you happy about everyday life because I'm very excited to have my own adult desk. I used to say things like that. My own adult this. And I've been an adult for three years now. I don't feel like an adult sometimes. Most of the time. But as a kid, I would like... I used to put dollhouse and house and I'd decorate the living... Like the downstairs, like a little living room and things like that. So when it all comes together and I actually get my own place, it's going to be really damn exciting. I'm, I'm ready for it. The favorite thing about up north though is that like if you look at the trees, there are consistently falling leaves and it's like it's constantly raining leaves on you, which I get at my home back in New Hampshire, but um, down in Mass where we go to school, not so much. You see it here and there, but like I feel like in New Hampshire, Maine, it's a consistent fall of leaves and it makes me really happy. <sighs> it's probably the best part being up here this time of year. Break of sunshine in the clouds. Stop yeah. complaining. It's gonna be fun. Are you ready? 
We got our paddle. Hate people who litter. It's like one of my biggest pet peeves. <sighs> Look at how beautiful this is. I'm very happy. I should be focusing on steering. Or I mean doing the power part, but look how pretty it is. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Do a pause canoeing on the still water. This is so beautiful. See, I want to own a canoe and a kayak one day and live near the water. You have to have a water access too. Yeah. We used to own a canoe. I would love to have that we got again. The house someone stole it. Mm, true. so much for watching don't forget to think of those five things you're grateful for every single day because honestly the world is terrible it's scary good days turn to bad days quicker than you could think and there's consistently something to complain about but there's also consistently something to be very grateful and happy about and there are always people who love you and want to take care of you whether you're aware that they're there or not they're there so if you are having a hard time, a hard day, a hard month, a hard year, know that you are not alone. Everyone goes through things like that. And I know that you don't think that they do, but I promise you that they do. Um, I've gone through really, really hard years and I feel like I'm consistently going through a hard year. But there are always things that are beautiful and that are out there to look at. And there are always people who are ready to support you if you just say the word. So have a great day, have a great night. Thank you for watching, keep your head up. Because there's a lot of beauty in the world and you're gonna miss it if you don't.